Hey guys, for is let you know that today you can go ahead and download Google Chrome for your Android device. And currently it's only for Android 4.0 ice cream sandwich. Um, so this is the real Google Chrome from, you know, Google. Um, and it's being called the Chrome Beta. Um, and as I said there, it's only available for Android 4.0. And I'm running here on my Samsung Galaxy Nexus, the GSM model. But should work, you know, fine with the CDMA model as well. But let's just go ahead and see what we got here if we fired up so this is what it looks like the first time you boot it up um, so it's 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 kind of cool actually it's 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 kind of badass so as you see it it instantly starts to sync with my computer um, so you can see uh, you can see your bookmarks over here you can quickly see uh, your visited websites uh, down here at the bottom uh, and also as I said there there uh, we have uh, some quick info lost sync 12 minutes ago so you can easily sync it with your computer if you have Google Chrome up and running it's kind of cool okay so if you have something up and running on your computer you can instantly get it here on your device so that's very badass uh, if you look here on the top search or type URL you just tap on that and then you can just go to something and then here you can see all my history uh, from my Google account this is fire up YouTube um, so one thing that I should tell you here pretty quick is that we are not gonna see Adobe flash for this because we, we heard uh, Adobe have discontinued the support for uh, like Adobe flash for mobile uh, mobile platforms um, so we're not gonna see more Adobe Flash for this Google Chrome web browser and Google and Adobe is going fully HTML5 so we should you know eventually start to see that more and more on YouTube you know uh, only HTML5 videos so it's gonna be kind of cool uh, when we don't have to think about Flash anymore um, so yeah that's basically the search uh, button you can type whatever you want um, cat cat a cat that's Google search, pretty quick. You can see that Google is changing the policy, but we already do know that. Uh, and also here you can have tabs, and, th and that's also pretty cool. Um, as you can see here, you can see all my open tabs, and then you can just quickly fire it up here. And it's kind of cool, kind of you know clever way that they have done that. Uh, let's just fire up uh, some of my history here. Swedish forum flashback, awesome. Um, yeah but now when when we click on our tabs here you can see that I have three tabs up and running and if I want to change here you can see that we get like this kind of cool like 3d effect I mean this is a very well made browser uh, very very well made uh, for us being Chrome beta right now uh, so you can you know instantly like oh my god this is this is clever this is badass um, and then also if you top up here we have incognito mode if you want to browse porn bookmarks other devices share finding page settings just load up settings here autofill forms uh, say passwords do all these kinds of crazy good stuff but seriously it it is Google Chrome very very impressive browser uh, and it sucks a little bit that they're not gonna have Adobe Flash uh, but you know eventually we will get to HTML5 but you know it sucks a little bit but uh, still it's very badass if you tap on other devices yes you can see my computer there so you can sync it one more time you know if you have opened up like a new tab I suppose but seriously it's very very cool I'm very impressed with the tab system over here uh, very very unique and everything um, and I never seen this before very cool um, and also if you want to close something you just can you swipe it maybe you just click up here yeah there we go that is badass so yeah and also I'm gonna stop saying badass but Ah, I just love it. It's it's so horny. It's it's so awesome. It's it feels so good. This is a wonderful browser. You you should definitely check it out if you have a Samsung Galaxy Nexus phone or if you're planning to get one or if you're running Android 4.0 ICS in general. I I think it it can work. 
Uh, and we do know that Samsung Galaxy S2 and like the Galaxy Note is going to get uh, Android 4.0 ICS in March. But it's going to be running on sucky Touchways UI. So yeah, that's going to suck. But yeah, it's cool. Still, I'm a... I still think that my Galaxy Note and my Galaxy S2 really, you know, kills in the browser performance. Even in the stock browser in the Galaxy Nexus, as you see, it's a bit like laggy sometimes. You know, just as with my iPhone 4S, you know, sometimes when you do it like this, it's slow, you know. My Galaxy Note, usually it's not slow. Um, so that's why I'm using the Galaxy Note as my main phone, because I really think it kills. It's a big S2. If you don't like the size, pick a Galaxy S2. But uh, yeah, just a very, very quick, quick look here. Um, if you want to go ahead and get this right now, you can go ahead and download it. I will try to link to the APK file uh, in the link description below. Also, they have, they have it, it's in the Android Market Store, but uh, I think it's only available for US people. So if you just want, if you are in another region like I was, you, you have to download the APK file and uh, use use Ash, uh, download Astro File Manager from like the market. And then you can just browse it, uh, browse the download file, and then you just go ahead and install the APK file. But the APK file was uh, coming from AndroidPolice.net, that website, I think. So, yeah, but that's cool. Awesome, Google. Bye bye.